I wanna go over my experience with Toro and would I still do it in 2024? And the answer is no. If you want my true answer, I would, this is really what I would do. If you were someone who has less or thinking about it, I would start on Toro, get to 10 cars, and then decide if you wanna go private. If you are already on Toro and you have more than five, six cars, I would definitely go private. Um, the reason being is I just don't, Toro's trash. <laughs> they, they really don't care about the hosts. They have changed so many different things and every time uh, my car accidentally like gets unlisted, then, and someone automatically books it, and then I say, I'm so sorry, this shouldn't have been listed, uh, they penalize me. And as you can see, I missed like a hundred and something dollars. But I also have fees, I'm sure, for cancellations. And I mean, I'm not a beginner on Toro whatsoever. I have over uh, five-star reviews. Uh, this is just over the last 365 days, and I haven't done anything since October of 2023. Um, all five stars, uh, I'm literally have, I think, like 200 ratings. Um, this says 26, but uh, it's really like 201. Um, so I'm not like a beginner at all uh, with Toro. Um, I just don't think it's a good platform anymore uh, if you're looking to scale a business. Um, in 2023 i kind of quit like i scaled it like right around here and then i was like you know what this is no good and i just denied it and so i took a thousand dollar hit on this one um, because i just didn't want to go use their platform anymore and i just slowly took all my cars off and now they are all unlisted i had eight cars and i just I think I had nine cars actually, but um, I sold a few of them. Some of them got totaled and now I think I have six. And so um, I won't be using, I wouldn't go on Toro again um, because of they just don't care about their hosts. Um, they are, the amount of like help that customer service does and a lot of the stuff, I don't know, man, just like auto booking, you can't choose um, if you want to deny someone, if you choose to deny someone and they, then you get penalized and it's just a bad system. They need to rethink how they, uh, they do their business because um, sure they're making a lot of money, but there's gonna be a, another company that comes and that is just better um, and it does better. Or I just can't wait for uh, uh, AI and automatic car rentals. And it's where it's not peer-to-peer. -peer. It's a AI tool like chat, like, what is it, uh, Tesla. I mean, I have a Tesla Y. Um, if I keep buying Tesla Ys and then they release their taxi service, then I'm golden versus the people that are now uh, have a bunch of cars that aren't electric or don't have, um, a good service, then they're gonna go out of business. So um, I'm excited about the future. I can't wait for AI to take over more. I think that it's going to really uh, shift the game for a lot of people. And I think we're gonna see just a huge um, fallout of jobs, which is fine because they'll probably be on like um, some kind of like universal pay kind of thing, which is fine. I mean, they'll just have, they can choose, I'm guessing. I, am, I'm, I wanna have like a whole video of like my thoughts on this. Um, Cause I'm, my thing is like kind of wacky when it comes to AI and uh, my thoughts on humans and especially, but uh, I'm excited for AI. I think that AI is, I think that people just don't understand the concept of like not working. Um, and that you can be on a universal, universal payment system and uh, live your life because AI is doing everything. Um, you have all your you know, necessities, your you know, water, food, shelter, clothing, transportation, you know, everything you need uh, is paid for essentially and you don't have to work 
but uh, you have no really value in the marketplace. So um, anyways, that's a whole different topic. Toro 2024, I would not do it. Go private, it's so much easier, so much better, and you can you don't have tor uh, turnover fees. I, I've i been doing quite well, uh, and I'm looking to scale this thing again. So um, that's it. Until next time, guys, remember to like and subscribe, smash the like button, and ring that notification. I'll see you on the next one.